Hey folks, so welcome back again. And as you may have seen, we're out here to look at a water meter removal. I don't know if this is an active colony. Uh, what I think may have happened is that initially the cover to that water meter was left open and when it rained, that likely probably made the bees abscond. So any little bit of bees that are in there are probably bees that may have emerged after the fact or maybe scavenger bees from around the area. Uh, there could be a pocket swarm of bees, maybe the bees clustered towards the corner of the water meter on the inside, who knows. But um, I'm grabbing you to bring you along. We'll at least open up the meter and we'll remove the wax and we'll see how it goes. So you can see all that comb, it looks all abandoned. And in the corner, I don't know if this camera will pick it up, the bees might be clustering in that corner back there. So I'm gonna try to gently remove the comb that I can, and then I'll lift the lid right out, and hopefully it should come out in one piece. Uh, but when I take that lid off, I'm gonna flip it upside down and set it to the side or I can flip it upside down and try to set it on this like flat surface here. Uh, but I do have my hive tool. I got a little small nucleus here set up. Uh, there's drawn comb inside there, there's honey frame, so bees will have something to eat. But let's go ahead and take a look. What I'm going to do for this top is I'm going to invert it and I'm going to try to gently shake the bees off into the little, I have a cardboard box top. So if I see the queen she'll be easy to find and I can put her in a queen cage. If not, then I'll continue to work inside the meter and see what they got going on in there. So stay tuned. Well folks, sorry, my battery kind of ran out here. Um, Job is done, no queen, handful of bees, maybe 50 bees around. Uh, there was no queen, no sign of a queen or queen cup or eggs or larva. It was just wet comb, so I'm fairly sure the rain made the bees abscond or leave. Uh, but any of the less, I got the, all the comb wax out. There was maybe a five gallon bucket full of that wax comb. And there you'll see I have a, a napkin that is doused with bee quick. It's a deterrent, so that'll keep the bees away. There's maybe like maybe a dozen bees flying around. You can't get them all. I'm not going to wait around for it. I do have maybe a handful or so bees in here. So that's it. I'm going to call it a day. Uh, sometimes, like I said, uh, with these water meter removals, you never know what you're going to get. Uh, <laughs> kind of like a box of chocolates, right? Uh, but no worries. Uh, thanks again for tuning in. Uh, hang in there, and I appreciate your patience as I bring you the next video upload. Take care and have fun with your bees.